Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. You guys don't really care about this car. <laughs> oh, man, but uh, you can see the wheels are gone. I got, it's my job, yeah. Uh, you know, it's my job, y'all. I have to report to y'all. This is what we're doing. But, again, the, the tires are gone, the rims are gone. I have them in uh, a rim repair shop, and uh, we're going to see if they can even be fix tomorrow they're gonna get back to me tomorrow and let me know so when i know you will know so i didn't even tell you guys about this one so mr rick if you remember my guy in la who has a body shop that before i had my body shop um, he asked me if his customer could ship his truck over here from Utah. And it was like 12 midnight. So I had to have it shipped to my house. And uh, the neighborhood Cameron called the police on me. So they came out, put, you know, the lines on here to see how long the, uh, truck is going to be here and they put this on the window also got another one what does this say yeah these Karens are a nuisance if nothing else I almost forgot yeah Another one. So they're here to get the truck now and get it up out of here. Cause this Karen that lives right there, her name is Helen. She wildin' B. She wildin'. She even said her name. And she said, my name is Helen, I'm not a Karen. <laughs> so because both front tires are flat and the tie rods are broken he does not well he's saying he can't pull it up on there even though he has a winch he can't and sorry this truck is so loud i don't know what they're doing over there but he cannot pull this truck up there because of the tires so we're gonna have to call somebody else and have somebody else come out and hopefully they can do it but either way, this is uh, what's going on today. I'm trying to help my boy, Mr. Rick, get this truck to his shop so he can do the body work on it. And uh, the situation was simply that AAA delivered this car to my house. And the reason why I had to come to my house and not my shop is because it was delivered at 12 midnight. And there was no way I was getting up out of my bed at 12 midnight to go to the shop to receive this truck so i had them send it to my house not knowing that the damage would be this substantial that it would hinder the car from being towed up on a trailer so fast forward to today obviously uh you know it can be towed up on here and uh you know we gotta figure out a way to get the truck up on the trailer any suggestions, guys? Even though by the time you guys will be seeing this, it will be handled. <laughs> so we're back at the shop and we're gonna see these wheels together because they dropped them off yesterday. So we did two. And boy, oh boy, do they look good. From first glance anyway. It's, okay, that's just dirt. I can get that off. This thing looks good, man. Yeah, they did a good job. These look like brand new, brand new Mercedes-Benz wheels. Wow, they did a hell of a job. You guys remember them chunks that was out of there? Let's see the front one, because the front was worse. Ooh, wee. Yeah, they did a hell of a job, y'all. They did a hell of a job. It's a little rough right here, though, right along... This ridge, it's kind of rough. 
But the rest of this is, man, you can't tell there was any damage on this. They did a hell of a job. I would give you guys their info, but they don't work with the public like that. You have to uh, basically be uh, a business for them. But anyway, yeah, I'm going to do these two next. We got to get this car buttoned up and then uh, we're going to do the rest of this. So we make your tracks on this Impala. I forgot the year. Don't kill me. But uh, we're doing we're doing big things really quickly on this. And believe it or not, we are pushing to have this ready in one more week. So we made some big strides on this. Thanks to Cruz. He's the one who did all the work. And look at this. Great job, right? Next time you guys see this, it's gonna look totally different. Yeah, I'm really serious about the CLS now, y'all. I'm really serious about it. Got this one, they go right here. Because obviously you can see that they are, uh, the clear coat is, is coming off. Any car that's sitting for a couple of years is gonna have the same problem. So I did this one already, and now I gotta do this one. All right, so we're done with the first half. Second half is the wet sand, 800. See the 800 sandpaper? So this is the next step, and then it'll be ready to be painted. Let's get it. So it's back, ladies and gentlemen, the Monte Carlo SS, fully custom. Hit me down in the comments, man. Let me know what y'all think about this one here. Right. I don't speak foreign. Let's give me a lot of ideas, a whole lot. I mean, we getting older, right? Yeah. He gotta make money, he gotta make sense. What we talking about, Flood? <laughs> Oh, they're here. And Butter's got a dead battery. When is that? 20 of 20, uh, 12 of 20. That battery should not be dead. I'm wondering if it's my alternator. I have no idea, but we're soon going to find out. What's up, bro? Hey, All right. Nah, customer. I'm about to say, man, what the hell happened? I don't know. No sympathy. You? No sympathy. What? No sympathy. What? No sympathy. What? No sympathy. What? No sympathy. I don't sympathize with these guys who cry broke. Always fly old money, but got it to buy smoke. You know him, ballin' to the bill come. Ain't even pop the cork from a bottle, yeah, you wanna drink some. Playing that violin, poor me. I'm the provider in my household. My lady can never support me. Never. Use a victim of your own problems. It's time to put your big boy pants on, homie. You can solve them. You took the stimulus money and bought sneakers. I put my money towards more beats and more features. You be sleeping on weekends. I do meetings on weekends. You big dummy. Fred Sanford in his grave tweaking. I got a beef with my beautiful black sisters. Big lashes, fake asses, and furry slippers. 40 old strippers. Twerking on the gram and got nerd to post up. You can't find you a good working man. And... The day I show empathy, it'll be a slope so slippery. They must have slipped cane at the end of your joint. You a Marty Mall symphony. Flush, what we got for him, homie? No, no sympathy. sympathy. Haters, no sympathy. Fellas, no sympathy. Ladies, no sympathy. You, no sympathy. What? No sympathy. What? No sympathy. What? No sympathy. What? Listen, nigga, my lawyer know I'm guilty. I'ma beat the charge anyway. The judge and the DA know a nigga about that gunplay. Brought a brick like school lunch, breaking down in all trades. My nigga Niggas catch flight to Chicago when the Knicks play. Desi got the cereal scratch just like a DJ. I sell you anything that you want, nigga. I'm BJ. 
day. Listen, bitch, I don't wanna conversate cause I'm rich. Brought a couple cars, a couple house, a nigga is lit. I mean, I sell coke, fuck bitches, and drink liquor. I got a gun that'll hit you in the next nigga. Invest in crypto, Fifth Ave is how I dress, nigga. Cause I'm a professor, once a week I gotta test niggas. I mean, I'm getting to the bag, you don't see the difference. I mean, you get a little money, but you not consistent. And you a worker trying to talk like you in boss positions. Go ahead and envy me. Your cousin tell him, no sympathy. Haters, no sympathy. Fellas, no sympathy. Ladies, no sympathy. You, no sympathy. What? No sympathy. What? No sympathy. What? No sympathy. What? No sympathy. Facts, right? As in this day, we ain't trying to bring you down, man. Uh -huh. We trying to show you how to be a leader and not a follower. That's all. Show you how to be a boss and not a worker. Just get to that Educate bag. Educate your mind. Get to the bag. Get to the bag. No sympathy for y'all. Thank you. Thank you, brother. I appreciate it. Yeah, you too. Y'all drive safely. Yeah, thank you, brother. Definitely. Yeah, I appreciate it. It was a pleasure. Likewise, brother. See you on the next one. Yes, sir. Beautiful, man. So these, these good brothers got this uh, truck out of my hair, and I'm so happy. Goodness gracious. Now I can sleep. I ain't got Karen uh, calling the police on me no more. Let's get out of here. So that'll do it on this one, y'all. It's a wrap, man. Next thing is that battery. You know what I'm saying? I checked out that battery. That's like $350, $360, something like that. But that's on the next video. This one is one and done. I'll see y'all on the next one. Who loves you, baby? <laughs>